In order to integrate our toggle to do mutation inside our to do item, go to to do item JS and import JQL from GraphQL tag. Here inside, you will see we have remove to do and we have toggle to do function, which currently uh, do nothing. Let's define our toggle to do mutation in the same way we did in the previous sections. Let's just go here to our graphical, copy paste our mutation. We already seen it's working properly and paste it here. Now we won't use mutation component in this example. We will use um, Apollo client sitting in context. So to bring that, we will use with Apollo high order component from React Apollo. Now what we need to do, instead of expo default to do item, we will expo default with Apollo to do item. So our to-do item will get an index to-do and it will also get a client, which will be an Apollo client. Now in our toggle to-do, what we can do, we can call client.mutate and specify which mutation we want to run. We already defined that, it's toggle to-do. We want to pass variables. ID will be to-do ID and is completed will be to-do is completed. And this is for variables and we will also pass optimistic response as just empty. Now what we need to do, we need to update our cache. By getting existing to do's. Well, we pass query get my to-dos, it's imported from to the private list. Now our new to-dos will be existing to-dos map. And if our ID equal to-do ID, then we will return is completed as uh, not t is completed. Basically we change our is completed property and else we don't need to update anything. So this is for new to do's. Now what we need to do is to write query where our query will be get my to do's and data will be to do's new to do's. So where it will get us, it will get us whenever I will update, I will see updates executed instantly. 